Hi, I'm Ruta Chang, the founder of RoboGals. The RoboGals story really begins with how I came to study engineering. In my final year of high school, I found out about an engineering camp through the school newsletter. Over four days, I learned about four different types of engineering. I got to build robots out of Lego, shoot water rockets into the sky, and build cars out of electronics, cardboard, and sticky tape. So even though my mum, like a typical Asian parent, wanted me to do medicine, I had my heart set on engineering. Of the 200 students in my graduating high school class, only three of us girls went on to study engineering straight out of high school. I thought that was just because Cairns is such a small and remote place, and that when I got to the big city of Melbourne, there were going to be heaps of people, including lots of girls, just as passionate about engineering as I was. I was so surprised when there were only five girls in my mechatronics engineering class out of the 50 students taking it. The seed for RoboGals was planted when I met with Professor Jamie Evans, who is most well known for being a really awesome lecturer who also sings and dances in his lectures. trying to get a group of students to go to Lauriston Girls School with Lego robots to teach the girls here robotics to get them interested in engineering. I thought, why just go to one school? Why not go to all the schools? So I got some friends together, including Kelly Chu, Angie Lim, B Vu, and Mark Parncutt, the latter of whom would be my second in command for the next five years. And so, when Robo Girls was barely a few weeks old, Marita Cold called 20 schools around Melbourne and signed up five of them. And as soon as uni started back for semester two, we were recruiting volunteers like crazy, including one who would stay with us for a very long time. Would you like to join RoboGals? Mm -hmm. Hi, sign up for RoboGals. Uh, okay, can I join? Yeah, sure. Robo. She's still going to be volunteering for us in 2013. And we just spent those first few months really getting into action conducted lots of school visits, and by the end of semester, we'd gone out and taught robotics to 124 girls from five schools around Melbourne. In 2008, Marita left to go on exchange to Imperial College London and left me in charge of RoboGirls. It was during this time that we came up with the six committee positions of a RoboGirls chapter. These are President, Secretary, Schools Manager, Training Manager, Marketing Manager, and Sponsorship Manager and these are still used in RoboGirls chapters all around the world today. And so by March 2009, we had two RoboGirls chapters, the University of Melbourne and Imperial College London. But I wasn't just going to stop there. Australian of the Year for 2012 is Marita Chang. We need to support and rally our kids, especially girls, to get them engaged in engineering and technology from a young age so that Australia can continue to produce world-class innovations.